described the feeling in this arena is ominous. There is a chill in the air. And King, what horrors must John Cena be prepared to overcome? Thanks, James. So how was your daughter's birthday? That was pretty good. That gift you sent her was fantastic. Hey, I gotta keep my number one fan happy. Ah! Oh! That's gonna hurt. What's up, John? Good luck tonight. Thanks, Joe. Hey, go easy on him. He's got a match. Yeah, right. Aw, oh, Jack. Your face marked up the floor. Have fun, you two. Running weekly episodic television show in history. This is Monday Night Raw. Oh no! Fella, you and I are going to die. Sheamus has Cena. He's going to throw him off the ramp. Oh, Cena caught himself. But Sheamus is there. Oh no, Jay. He can't, Sheamus. Can't really do this. Not this. No! <laughs> oh no. John Cena is barely moving. Only fuck for this. Keep it safe. Sheamus is on a mission. He says that he wants Cena's title, and then he'll do whatever it takes to do just that. Cena already has an opponent at bragging rights in four weeks' time. But the Celtic warrior might have something to say about that. Good night. Welcome to Monday Night Raw. The WWE prepares for battle as Team Raw and Team SmackDown will square off at bragging rights in just three weeks. That's right, Michael. What's this to hear about being forced to compete for Team Raw? The truth is, Team Raw, Team SmackDown, I couldn't care less. All I want is a title match against John Cena at bragging rights. Hold on a second there, fella. I think the truth is, you're too scared to face us. I'm scared of no man. Not that I see any in front of me. You... You... You need to try looking in the mirror sometime, because the only thing more terrifying than that mug is Wade Barrett's butchery of the English language. What do you want? On second thought, I don't care what you want. You come out here and make fun of me, that was a mistake. So, I'll get a couple of fellas and the three of us will see the three of you later tonight. Oh no, please. I really don't want to see that face again. I don't think I can do it. That's it. I'm going to throw Barrett off the ledge. Too much swagger and Miz are there for the save and now it's Sheamus. Wow. Sheamus is on fire. Miz, Barrett, and Swagger may be in serious trouble tonight. Come in. I don't know what that's about. Oh, man. You just don't cross Wade Barrett. 
Wade Barrett had enough. And Team SmackDown may have just paid a huge price. And Team Raw comes out better for it. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Monday Night Raw. Last night's preview as three members of Team Raw face three members of Team SmackDown. And while Team Raw got the win, it was Team SmackDown's Wade Barrett that made it happen. Well, get in the way of Sheamus right now, regardless if you're on Team SmackDown or Team Raw. The Celtic Warrior is a man possessed. With bragging rights just two weeks away, what will he do next? staying limber before our match this Sunday. I just wanted to let you know, I've been notified that the team that wins the bragging rights match will receive future title matches. Wow! So you can either tear each other apart now, or you can save it for Team SmackDown. The choice is up to you. How's that for an incentive? Let's talk later. I have an idea.
goes out. And now both teams are even at two apiece. Oh, my gosh. What? Ah. What are Stavis and Wade Barrett doing? Coleman. What's going on here? I don't know. Do we have a winner? Apparently, Sheamus, Regal, McIntyre, and Barrett think we do. What does all this mean? If I wanted to hit you, I'd have done it already. So what is it? Come to complain about me and me mates being number one contenders? Well, yeah. You see, however, technically, you didn't win last night. Nobody did. The match never ended. But the WWE still needs number one contenders. So... I've come to tell you that at Survivor Series, you and your new friends will face Alberto Del Rio, Jack Swagger, Big Show, and, well, me. Oh, and about that not hitting you thing, I lied. Let's do this. See you at Survivor Series, if you can make it. being beaten down last week. That's right. Tonight it's Del Rio that's going to bed early. And more importantly, it's Sheamus that builds momentum for his team at Survivor Series. Swagger, shoulder first. Yeah, but look where he is. Watch Big Show! Two slam! Sheamus oh. and Barrett are out! But it looks like Big Show had a good time tonight. And if Sheamus and his cohorts want to have any fun at Survivor Series, then they'll need some way to stop the world's largest athlete. The gentlemen are down the hall. We have work to do. 100 pound monster coming this way, gentlemen. And I'm of the opinion that he doesn't make it out of this garage in one piece. I like it. Barrett and I can handle this fella. You two see that we're left alone. Before we get started, I wanted to let you know this is going to hurt you a lot more than it does us. Who's it hurting now? WWE presents Survivor Series. In a showdown, a month in the making, is finally here. Who wants any part of this? Well, it doesn't matter what it wants. This man's about to be the passage of his life. Oh my, talk about your miracles. Boy, that's one angry looking giant. This is impossible. He can't participate. The match is nearly over. Not only is he going to participate, Lord Regal, but Big Show showing no hesitation. Oh, look out! A spear! A spear from the 485 pound Two, Big Show. Three. Oh, there's no way Drew's getting up from that. And now Big Show's begging Sheamus to bring it. Sheamus hoisting the mammoth Big Show to his feet. Bro kick, no! Big Show catches the boot. Sheamus goes down. Why can I? Barrett set flying. Ah, uh, the Big Show's on a tear. And Regal goes flying off the apron. Bro kick. Sheamus just knocked Big Show out. One, two, three. 
And now the only person keeping the United Kingdom from victory is Edge. Sheamus scoops Edge up, throws him over his shoulder. Edge is in trouble. Oh, what a counter from Edge. Edge grabs the legs. One, two, three. No, Sheamus kicks out. And now he's thinking spear. And Sheamus doesn't know where he is. Sheamus is in serious jeopardy. Edge is calling for it. Sheamus sidesteps. Oh, what a kick to the skull. Out of nowhere. One, two, three. The United Kingdom has, has done it. And now the entire WWE needs to, well, they need to watch their backs. The World Heavyweight Champion, John Cena. Now I got it. Well, it looks like Sheamus finally wormed his way into a title match. So at TLC, Sheamus and I will go toe-to-toe -to -toe for the World Heavyweight Championship. Now, if you know your history, the first time Sheamus and I competed at TLC, I slipped and went through a table. And that stumble allowed Sheamus to win the WWE Championship. Sea Nation, I promise you, this time I will not stumble. You're right, John. I'll beat you with TLC, and in four weeks, I'll do it again. But right now, I'm going to remind you what it means to deal with the power of the Celtic Warrior. Sheamus, over here. It looks like you've also earned a shot against me for my United States Championship. Well, here's the thing. I'm not a patient man. If I have to face you, I'd just as soon do this tonight. I can see you're not too keen on the idea. But the thing is, I am. So don't move an inch, Sheamus. I'll be right there. United States Champion. Oh, this isn't good, Michael. I have a bad feeling about what lies ahead at TLC. He would be both camp. The rest of WWE needs to be on high alert. The United Kingdom is here to stay. Please show some respect. You're in the presence of the new United States Champion. Lord McIntyre, I'm afraid we expected this. You see, Americans have no respect for themselves. And they have no respect for each other. So why should they have any respect for their United States Champion? They just don't have any respect for you guys. Very true, Lord Seamus. And with that kind of attitude, why would anybody want to be champion of these United States? For that very reason, I have retired the championship of one worthless country. And I'm reinstating the championship of the world's greatest continent. I hereby declare myself the European Champion. Declare yourself European Champion? What gives you the right to declare anything? In fact, what gives you the right to disrespect these people? and this country. If you want respect, you gotta earn it. And as far as I can tell, you boys have been cheating your way to the top. At TLC, I won't need to cheat to beat you. 
Well, that won't really matter, dude, because our match at TLC will be a chair match, meaning we can both do whatever we want to each other. I didn't agree to that. I didn't agree to that! Well, you didn't agree to this either. Drew, you, and Sheamus have a match right now against me and this guy. adjustment Ooh. yeah John's gonna win oh no the ref is out look out oh right to the temple Barrett just stole this match one two three here are your winners the Celtic warrior Seamus and Drew McIntyre Nice job. Now I need your help next week with Undertaker. Undertaker has to be around here somewhere. Where did he go? Ugh. Ugh. Ah. Who? Ah. We want to see you in the ring now. Do it. Oh no! Ring the bell. Sheamus and Barrett have had enough of Kane and Undertaker. Well, they might be able to run away tonight, but in two weeks at TLC, there'll be no place to go. Did it tonight, King, but did the UK win again on Sunday? Well, they have a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. The United Kingdom looks as powerful as ever, but Ezekiel Jackson and Christian, Rey Mysterio, Undertaker, and John Cena will not back down an inch. TLC, this Sunday on pay-per-view, can the British invasion be stopped? WWE presents TLC. Adjustment over the top rope. Yeah, but did you see the way Sheamus landed? It looked like he blocked some of the impact. Well, it doesn't matter because Cena's going up. Cena's going to win. Wait, look at Sheamus. Look at Sheamus. Oh, man, this is awful. No, he can't. He did! High cross! And John Cena landed with a sickening thud outside the ring. I don't believe this! How did this happen? King, the United Kingdom has won every title in WWE. New World Heavyweight Champion, John Before you is every champion in WWE today. You see, when a man or woman from Great Britain puts their mind to a task, it gets 
accomplished. I've been in this industry long enough to see many groups come and go. The Generation X, Evolution, the Four Horsemen, and the men that formed those factions were all outstanding. But they were just men. Peasants, if you will. We are kings. We come from countries of nobility and honor. We are superior to you. We, the United Kingdom, are superior to your four horsemen. It can't be! I think that's the music of the four horsemen, King! It's the enforcer of the four horsemen, Arn Anderson! I'm sorry, William. My hearing's not as good as it once was. Did you just say your group, the United Kingdom, that's been around for the length of a sneeze, is superior to the Four Horsemen, a group that dominated for 20 years? Did I hear that right? That's exactly what he said. Drew, you talk out of turn again, I'll come down there and take you over my knee. Do you understand? Look here, you dinosaur. If you don't think the United Kingdom is better than the Horsemen, then we can find out right now. Look, Seamus, my competitive days are over. But if you're feeling frisky, I think some can be arranged. Now, just a sec. Let me think. I have it. John Cena told me just a couple of minutes ago he was looking forward to his rematch. But he doesn't want to wait until Royal Rumble. Seamus, you and Cena are going to tangle right now. Going for high cross. But Cena counters. Ooh. STF. STF locked in. Sheamus hit the ramp. Was that accidental? Oh, I doubt it. Here comes McIntyre. Wait a minute. It's Arn Anderson. Ooh. DDT. McIntyre's skull first. Cena. Cena's going to win. Attitude uh. adjustment. One, two, three, go! No. McIntyre breaks it up. How close was Cena? Uh. And the ref has no choice but to disqualify Sheamus. Again, I have retained my World Heavyweight Championship against John Cena. Yeah, but you didn't beat him. And now Cena wants to try again at the Royal Rumble to take the title from me. Fella... It's not going to happen. And the same goes for Lord McIntyre and Lord Regal's opponents tonight. Boy, you know what? You guys are pretty crafty. See, here's the thing. Daniel Bryan and I are pretty crafty too. The UK has been banned from ringside for our tag match. So why don't you go and work on your tan, Seamus? So Kofi Kingston and Daniel Bryan will face the WWE Tag Team Champions, William Regal and Drew McIntyre. Yeah, and the best part is that the United Kingdom is banned from ringside. For Kingston, but Kofi counters. Regal staggers. Yeah. Oh, what a leap by Kofi. This young man is so agile. Kofi's going to... Oh, what a shot by Regal. Did you see that? It looked like Regal just threw something out of the ring. Yeah, I think Regal grabbed Two, something from his tights three. right as Kofi was going for trouble in paradise. Here are your winners. Gang, look William at this. Regal. It's Arn Anderson. And Drew McIntyre. Apparently he saw it too. Oh, look, Michael. It was brass knuckles. The referee has reversed his decision. Your winner, by disqualification, well, Kofi and Bryan earned the victory, but Regal and McIntyre will retain the titles as they can't change hands on a disqualification. The United Kingdom escapes again. To the cutting edge. You know, it's great to be in my old haunts. And speaking of old, my guest tonight is about as old as it gets. Ladies and gentlemen, the enforcer, Arn Anderson. Mr. 
Anderson. It's good seeing you again. Can... Can you see me? Oh, Edge. I've always loved your sense of humor. Speaking of funny, do you smell something funny? Arn, did you forget to change your adult diaper? You know, I can't figure you out, Edge. I thought you were having your own problems with the United Kingdom. Well, I always say, if you can't beat them, join them. And speaking of join them, I give you the United Kingdom. Arn, you need to relax. You wouldn't want anything bad to happen. Like hell I don't. I'll move on. and I approve of this message. Good job, guys. Guys? Well, here's the thing, Edge. Nobody asked you. These men are capable of the unthinkable. After what Edge said to a legend like Arnold, he deserves this. Do you know who I am? Yes. And now you'll never forget who we are. But the Rated R Superstar comes up with a huge counter. Man, what a huge DDT that was. Wait, look outside the ring. Uh oh, stopped by the Enforcer. And Edge hits the spear. We got a cover. Two, three. Edge. Arn Anderson and John Cena win. Yeah, but will Cena be victorious again at the Royal Rumble? We'll find out this Sunday on Pay-Per-View. WWE presents Royal Rumble. Need to talk to Cody. Oh, hey, champ. Arn, if I may, your plan was brilliant. One of these days, the fans will learn. When it comes to Arn Anderson, you better be careful what you wish for. About as soon as they learn that Edge can never be trusted. Edge, well done there, fella. We couldn't have done it without you. And you, Seamus, you may be the most courageous man I've ever met. <laughs> Why is that? I mean, 
I wouldn't think a group like yours would want to divide its forces in the two Elimination Chamber matches. Perhaps the most grueling, barbaric match we have. I mean, one world champion is going to face five of the fiercest competitors in the WWE. Right? Well, myself. And Sheamus, that takes guts. And there's a pretty good chance we could see them spilled. If you know what I mean. Oh well, I'm sure you'll do great. See you, Arn. Well, kid, I bet it'll be a great funeral. Take it easy. Regal joins the United Kingdom member Wade Barrett at Elimination Chamber. And I'm sure Wade Barrett will rest a little easier tonight, knowing William Regal is going to share the chamber with him. Now I'm going to use small words so that you can all understand me. I'm going to face King Drew Drew here alone. Do you understand, Barrett? You've got to go. And King Drew Drew, after I'm done beating you, I'm going to take the title off your friend, the Lord of the Uglies. Because I'm the Miz! And I'm awesome! Oh, what a counter. A great counter by the Miz. And now Miz going for the skull crushing finale. Yeah, well, he better watch out. Right in the jaw. McIntyre just got blasted. And here comes the rip. Miz advances to Elimination Chamber. Barrett oh, can't believe what just uh, happened. You screwed me, Wade. I made a mistake, Sheamus, but it's one that can be rectified. If I may, one of the competitors, Senor Del Rio, is hanging around outside. Now, we can take out a major threat and get McIntyre into the match in one go, if we act now. This had better work. I'm sick of Barrett's mistakes. He's a liability. Are you with me? Yes, I'm with you. WWE presents Elimination Chamber. championship. Oh, Big Show was so close, but Barrett found a way to win. And Sheamus and William Regal join Wade Barrett in the celebration. Wait a second. Huh. Oh! Huh. Huh. Sheamus and Regal huh. of Snap King. This has been brewing over the last several weeks, Michael, but I'm still in shock. Huh. Wade Barrett's been expelled from the ranks of the United nothing. Kingdom. Sheamus going after the Miz, and Miz ah. fights him off, thumb to the eye. Ah. Sheamus just got rocked with a big lift. Oh, crushing finale. Ooh. Sheamus blocks it. And Cena's right there. Uh-oh. Attitude adjustment. Like a vulture, Sheamus swoops in to pick up the scraps. You didn't see that, Cena. Three. 